Greetings and salutations, my name is JW608, and today I am playing Star Maid, and we are going to begin our uh, hospital station. I guess I could call it a medical station. That might be better. Well, I guess it is sort of more of a hospital. I don't know. We're going we're gonna to build it anyway. So let's see here. How are we going to start? Well, let's start with the station, and let's give this station like a little landing platform, if you will. Not a literal landing platform, but a... Well, it's going to become a literal landing platform, but this is going to be my little work area. So I can put stuff and things here. Uh, let's grab a display module as well. Um, where did my display modules go? I assume past them. There we go. To leave me notes on what I'm doing. All right, so let's see. Let's block some things out first. Uh, let's grab some port and starboard buttons. And port is going to be over here. Starboard. Oops, I didn't set that. And starboard over here. Uh, let's see. Uh, and we're going to do a center line here. Okay. This is not actually part of the station. This is just just uh, helping me. And that's a center line and I want the front of the station to go this way. All right. Now we're cooking with gas. You know, I've never actually cooked with gas. I've always had an electric stove. All right, there we go. Now, we're going to jump back this way, and we're going to work on the actual station back here. So, let's see. The first thing we need to do is grab some dark gray basic and maybe some even gray gray basic, or regular gray basic. Uh, let's start right here-ish. Seems like a good place to start. And one, three. Hmm. Let's block this into fives. One, two, three, four, five. There we go. And let's copy selection. No, let's not copy selection. I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Give me a moment. So let's have this the center. And let's make a door, an entryway, an entry door. Uh, let's see here. How about we do, um, we don't want this to be pretty. So let's see here. How about some, um, some of these carved materials like Chavez. Okay, I kind of like that. And um, how about some, maybe Cinnabar? Oh, do I like Cinnabar better than Chavez for the floor? Oh, you know what? We'd like to do this mosaic, tile type stuff. Ooh, I kind of like that. That kind of works, too. All right, so then let's see here. How about two, and let's give it some of this. There we go. Two, three, four. Hmm. Not sure how I like that. Uh, but let's see. Let's grab some door. Uh -huh. Door, door, door. Where is the door? Uh, let's grab this kind of door and this flavor of door. Hmm. Let's unset that. Let's just have... There we go. So I'm ha I sort of have the idea of like this little enclosed area that... Like a hallway going to the docking areas. Then entering this little enclosed area. Then going into the foyer proper. And I want it to come up... 
one, two, three, four, five, one, two, three, four, five. I want it to have a, a base of five. Then I'm thinking about this grand triangular ceiling. Two, three, four, five. Yeah. And then having it come down. Uh, no, I want the hospital wings. I'm sort of just thinking of this way. Having an entry point that splits off into two wings, if you will. And then having these wings actually extend upwards like five levels. So I'll have five levels of, well, this is not really indicative, but five levels of like hospital rooms. I want like hospital rooms on one side and staff and things like that. And I want research and labs and diagnostics and things like that on the other side. And maybe have like a cool air bridge to gap them or multiple air bridges to gap them. Air bridges, space bridges, walkways, walkways. There we go. Sort of what I'm envisioning. And then having this, um, like, triangular, it's not going to do what I want, but it's sort of a, it's a, an actual triangle. I guess that might be better. Triangular type roof, if you will, for the, uh, for the, um, lobby central hub so this is going to be one of the doorways into the central hub and that's going to be one two three we're just going to leave it at three tall so the wings will be taller than it one two three four five all right okay so this is just that's just for me all right Anyway, uh, well, we'll, well, we will cross that bridge when we get there. So you have these little doorways, and I don't like that. I want something a little classier. Um, dolum? Maybe? Nice carved dolum. Oh, and then in here we can, like, um, Oh, where'd it go? We'll stop that. Ah, we can offset the nice gray, gray and dolum walls. Well, of course, with like glass and whatnot. Too bad we don't have like carved dolum and things of that nature yet. That would be very nice. Uh, so let's grab this and bring it up here. And I don't know how wide I want this. That's one, two, three, four, five. That's five injury doors. That's probably fine. Five doors in and out to the main hallway vestibule type deal. And on either end, we will cap these off. Um, like Maybe like this. I, I'm not exactly sure what I'm doing here. And we're going to need lights. Definitely going to need lights. No, I want... I want this to be covered like an overhang. Then you step through the overhang and into the big expansive room. Okay. So let's get rid of all that then. Hey, I'm working on it. I'm probably going to do at least a little of this off camera, but I wanted to get started and sort of explain myself with with y'all here. And these, let's go ahead and just stick uh, windows in here. Uh, what type of crystal do I want? I I tend to use the black crystal a lot, or dark crystal, if you will. This is black or dark. That's black crystal. I guess it's better than being dark crystal, so I don't have all these weird turtle creatures attacking me. Alright, so let's see here. And... Um, 
something like that. Except I want this to go out another five. One, two, three, four. And then the wall would be here. So we'd have wall. No. Uh, it's one, two, three, four, five, and wall. There we go. All right. I'm getting there. I'm getting there. So it's one, two, three, four, five. And let's see here. Uh, I don't want them being three anymore. Okay. Looks kind of nice. And again, we'll have a nice fancy, fancy uh, pattern. Actually, let's come over here to our little work palette here. Well, we can make a fancy pattern here. So, I don't know. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Yes, I know I could have done that with my brush like a hundred thousand times faster. But, I don't know. What other colors do I have? Um, I have Lucra. Kind of a yellowy color. One Varus. I, I, I'm thinking keeping these like earth tones. But I don't want it like too busy. Hmm. Would that be too busy? I don't know. We're going to see. And I have to remember I have its brother over there. Actually, it's probably going to be cut off, so we're going to start in the middle. Let's not start in the middle. The middle is going to have its own design. No, I don't think that's too, too busy. Oh, oh, that's right. This block does... it tiles wrong with the shadows. Hmm. I'm going to have to work on that. I don't really want to... I guess we could do this. And then, uh, one, one, two, three, four, five, two, well, GW, if you're going to do that, just build it here, dumb. All right, so, oh, no, 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 three, four, five, there we go, okay. Well, no, if you do that, then... That's strange. The shadows don't rotate wrong if I do it that way. Okay. Well, that's interesting to know. And let's take this red all the way down and... Hmm. Yeah, there needs to be something here as well. And again, something along that line. And something down the middle, too. Let's try this down the middle, just this Lucra. And the Carveris. There we go. Hey! It's actually kind of spiffy looking. I like that. And... Uh, let's go with um, oh, let's go with some lights installed on the floor, like some white light. There we go. Give it some like lighting. <laughs> let's see, and let's throw this guy down here and go nine. And is symmetry gonna work for me? Probably not. Oh, nope, see, symmetry doesn't work with these metal bars. That's why I try not to use them a lot. Oops. There we go. You know, I guess I could have made those light bars, but... Huh. Okay, then we'll have the desk here and probably like waiting areas or tables or desk or something. Or chairs, not desk. 
and then have the actual this Lupra expand out and have the um, reception desk right here. So you have this nice impressive walkway and thinking, wow, this is impressive. Then you hit the reception desk. Great. I think that's coming along nicely. I have been JW608. This has been Star Made, and I will dig you cats later.